The Reaper, July 3rd, 2022. My day has arrived. Who shall greet you, my children? I ask you this day, who have you prepared for at your gates? You know he is coming. You know to have your homes in order. Who are you preparing for? You have decorated your town squares. You have decorated your homes. You have washed your walls and prepared your food. Who shall be your guest? I watch you as you claim to be of me, yet you mix with the seed of the world. I watch you as you dance the dance of debauchery and as you sing the music of the deceiver and as you bring your spoils into your homes. Who do you say that I am? Do you serve a blind Elohim who cannot see you move as the ant carrying your loads of spoils into your homes? I watch you as your town squares are filled with the lewd, and I see the banners raised high in your cities. I watch as you laugh at the jokes of the world, and as you watch their programs of entertainment in your private chambers, and I see you greet the pagan and the lewd on the road. Do you serve a deaf Elohim who cannot hear the songs of the world that you sing? and cannot hear the filth of your mouth? Your songs make you dance as the pagan, and you sway in the dark as the drunkard, and I hear your whispers that even the birds dare not repeat. Do you serve a maimed Elohim who cannot reach you? Do you serve a mute Elohim who cannot call the stars to fall upon you? I shall call your name, O man. Shall you bring your spoils to present them before me? What do you have in your homes, O man? Shall you give me your spoils and I accept them? Shall you be clean before me? I have sent my messengers to you, but you have ignored them. I have warned those who stand in my holy pulpits, standing before the people to speak my words only after they have bared their hearts before me, and I instruct them. But they did not obey. Seventeen months ago, my daughter warned you of my sickle with the sharp blade. Did you heed her warning? This day, I have held my hand poised to strike. Are you even aware that Elohim has called your name? This day, I release the reaper. This day, he carries my sickle. Who shall he be, my children? My children, my children, my children. Which reaper shall come through your gate? Shall he be grim? Or shall he be the harvester? Shall the arch of the sickle cause you heartache or rejoicing? The day is here. My accounting has come. My assembly is called. You shall live or die by the harvester. You shall be judged by your ways of man and your love of the flesh. You shall be judged by your words that will testify before you. Your words shall greet the reaper. The words will come from your chambers. You will not be able to hold them back. Have your chambers been filled with prayers to your God or filled with the secret lust of this world? As a traveler is greeted from a long journey, so shall your words greet the reaper at your gate. My children, have you not been warned that what is done in secret shall be seen in the light? Have you not been told that what you whisper in the closet shall be proclaimed from the rooftop? Have you not been instructed to not become one with the world? You have not protected your holy seed. You have not protected the seal that was once placed upon you. You have not protected your young from the poison of this world. You have allowed the lullaby of trickery to entice you to trust the world with your holy children. You have allowed commerce of the world to lure you into making evil common to your hands. 
Your minds are divided. You cannot serve two masters. One will overtake the other and rule the heart. I tell you this day that your guest, whom you have invited, shall arrive. The reaper is coming. He knows you by name. Destruction is coming. Calamity is coming. The harvester is coming. Shall he count you in his yield as one faithful and true? Or shall the greeting become grim as the sickle is raised? I shall destroy those who are imposters in my kingdom. Does not my word say that at the feast where the poor and the crippled are the invited guests, that the imposters are removed, tossed outside, and the doors barred? Does not my word say that imposters who speak my son's name, cast out demons in my son's name, and perform miracles in his name shall be unrecognized? The imposters shall be removed by the harvester. Imposters prepared for a grand visit shall have their day turned into mourning and bloodshed. I warn you this day, the reaper is coming. I warn you this day, I have sent him forth with a sickle with a sharp blade. Shall he harvest you, recognizing you as the wheat, or should he cut you out as the wheat tossed with the tares? I warn you this day, I am cleaning my house. I shall clean the earth of the imposters. Only those marked with my seal shall remain as workers for the harvest days ahead. The weeds who have grown within the fields shall be removed. Much wailing is coming. My children, clean yourselves before me. My children, clean your homes. Clean your eyes and your ears of this world. Clean the words of your mouth and make them the meditations of your heart to be pleasing before me. The storm is ahead. Days of sorrows are coming. Days of pestilence and famine have been released. Oh man, how I've warned you. Oh man, how I've called you as a mother calls her little children to her arms. My children, I have watched you. Prepare now. Prepare for your visitor. The days of harvesting has begun. It shall begin in my house. The days of sorrows has begun. He who has ears, let him hear.